Hi everyone, my name is Kelsey. And my name is Becky. And we are the Sorry Girls. And we are doing some DIY fall fashion today and I'm so excited to share this with you guys. They turned out so good and you're gonna be looking so sweet this fall. Yeah, fall fashion is one of my favorite times ever because you can just do so much and I love layering. So this video is extra fun to make. <laughs> and just to note, everything that we are wearing in these looks will be in the description. So click the links if you like anything that you see in the video. And subscribe before we jump into this video. Yes, we would love to have you as part of our channel. Okay, so let's jump in with the first look. Yes. This first look we're calling the flirty in flannel look. Finding a chill shirt dress that isn't too short can be hard, so we DIY'd one. Start by getting two flannel shirts that you either don't wear anymore or pick up some from the thrift store. Make sure they're roughly the same size to make this super easy. Cut both shirts in half. You can adjust how much you take from each to achieve the right length for your dress. Take the top half from one and the bottom half from the other and pin the good sides together while they're inside out. Sew the two halves together and your shirt dress is done. We styled this with a faux sheepskin jacket and some knee-high boots. Next up is our joggers but not jogging look. For this style, we DIY'd ourselves some cropped sweats that we're loving this season. Start with some old sweatpants you don't wear anymore or grab a pair from the thrift store. Since ours are flared at the bottom, we pinned and sewed a diagonal line from the knee down to the bottom to tighten them. Do this for both legs and then cut off the extra fabric. To tighten up the bottoms even more, we're adding an elastic band. Measure the distance around your calves and cut two strips of some thick elastic. Roll up the bottom of the pants and sew a tube for our elastic. Make sure you leave a gap. Feed the elastic through the gap and sew the elastic together. Close the gap up and your chilled out fitted sweats are finished. To complete this look, we added a faux fur biker jacket, a graphic tee, some oversized sunnies, some hoop earrings, and some low top satin sneakers. If sweaters aren't the biggest fall fashion staple, I don't know what is. This next look is called Loafing in My Loafers. To accessorize this outfit, we DIY'd some super trendy furry loafers. Start by picking up some black flats. You can find these literally everywhere for super cheap that you don't mind cutting up. Cut down the sides on an angle and then trim off the back. Using some shaggy faux fur, cut out a long U shape that fits nicely over the opening of the shoe. P.S. We tried covering the entire base of the shoe with fur, but it was pretty hard to walk in. Next, take a small strip of the fur and glue it fur side up right under the top of the shoe. You want a little bit of fur to be peeking out here. For the final touch, we picked up this chain charm from the craft store. Cut off two charms and adjust the chain length in the middle to be as wide as the shoe. Super glue the two charms in place on either side of the shoe. To complete the comfy factor of this look, add your oversized fall sweater, your comfiest jeans, and your classic sunnies. Our last look is called the CEO, Chief Executive Off the Shoulder Look. One of our favorite and easiest fashion DIYs is the blanket scarf. We have a tutorial we will link below on how to make your very own. We paired the blanket scarf with an off the shoulder sweater. These two make a perfect pair. Cold shoulders, blanket scarf's got your back. Or shoulders. <laughs> with the lower half, we have these gorgeous paper bag waist pants from H&M and these maroon gold tipped booties for a pop of color. To finish it off, we added a black cabbie hat. Everything's linked below. All right, we hope you guys enjoyed those fall fashion DIYs mm -hmm. and little lookbook. Mm -hmm. I'm impressed with myself at how great those DIYs look, so I'm hoping you guys love them as much. Let me know what your favorite was below. If you guys haven't seen our fall decor video, you should definitely check that out. We'll link it below and up here. Yeah, we did it very recently. We're still on the fall vibe trend. <laughs> Cannot get enough. All right, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like it, make sure you give it a like. And if you love it, make sure you sub it. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.